All right, so welcome to The Walking Dead. And we're gonna play it. <laughs> Go and new game. Let's go with the standard. Episode 2, it's time for help. Let's go with the episode 1. Let's play it. Let's play it. Game series adapts to the choices you make, the story is tailored by how you play. Okay, the walking dead. Uh, episode 1, A New Day. What is this? Yeah, that, uh, that's a cop car. Okay, we're been arrested. Read by Shen Vanaman. Shen Vanaman. Okay, okay. Go back, let's go back. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. What? Um, we well, you know what? This uh, does it really matter? Okay, let's go to the tree. Does it really matter? Yeah, yeah, does nah, it really matter? Not much. You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the I didn't do it. And um what do you say? And what do you say? I say yep, I know you didn't. Now into the target of the real I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Uh so you've got an opinion? You've got an opinion then? Wouldn't say that. I go in for that innocent till proven guilty thing. Even considering who they say you kill. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a six year. You meet your wife in Athens? Uh, I didn't know about the story, so... You want to know how I see it? Uh, sure. Sure. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. The backstory. Uh -oh, she married the wrong guy. driving this man once he he was the worst one he wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it he was an older fella big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses and he just wailing back there says it wasn't him crying and snotting all over right where you're all sitting officers are available for he coming to one. then before long he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane not tell him he's got to stop that's Dude, government property, the... and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, the road. having exhausted all his options, the road. he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Uh, so did he do it? So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting uh -oh. her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. Do, this do, one's do, a little do, bit do, less depressing do, and a bit more person, hilarious if I do say so. Watch out, watch out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Oh my goodness. What the oh my god. Okay, where am I? I'm awake now. Oh, oh shit. shit. Woohoo! Thirsty. Ah! Fuck! My leg! And I'm still hand off. Okay, use them all. It's, it's, it's the cup. Hey! Hey, officer! Are you alright? I'm still cut back here! Well, I think he's already dead. Why the hell did he have his gun out? Yeah, what the hell? Um, anybody, anything, anything else? Yeah. Uh. Oh no. Uh. Come on, come on, come on. I need to drag Drop myself, myself out, out that window. window. I need to drag myself out that window. Okay, what am I gonna do? Okay, okay. Oh no. Where's the key? Where's the key? What am I supposed to do? Maybe it was tossed from the car during the wreck. I don't know. Officer! Oh, that doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the car. Oh. You can move. Come on, come on. Oh. Oopsie. Oh my gosh. Oh, we fall from the road. Uh, oh my god. The... Okay, uh, let's move forward along the car. What happened to the officer? The officer? Can I need your help? Hey, 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 hey. The, the gun. officer's shotgun is over. Hey, I, I think you see uh, shotgun shell over here. Oh my gosh. Come on, pick it up, dude. Yeah. And cock the shotgun. Why would he have needed that? Why would he have needed that? Just pick it up. Why would he have needed that? To protect ourselves. Officer? Officer. Damn. Officer. Sir, what happened to you, officer? Hey, officer. Uh, officer? Officer, where are you, officer? Okay, I can do go over there. God damn. God damn. Where, where's the next? Why would he have needed that? Oh, oh I can take the shot. Yeah. Okay. Looks empty. Load the shell. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Okay. I'm gonna go back to officer. Oh no. Officer? God damn. Where am I supposed to go? I'm gonna pick up it up. <sighs> You already got the shell. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Anything else? Anything else? Okay, so I'm gonna need something. Officer? Officer, I didn't know what to do. Let's go over there. Can't even pick it. God damn. God damn. 
Happy sir. Oh, okay, okay. So that should be. Oh my gosh. Um. Okay, let's unlock this. Oh sh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I think. I think he's a zombie now. Ah! Grab the shotgun! Shoot the fucking shotgun! 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 I'm sorry, officer! I'm sorry! God damn it! Ah! Don't make me do this! Freaking officer! Stop it! Stop it! Oh my Christ! Dead! What the hell is this? Oh yeah. What should I do now? Help! Go get someone! There, there's, hey, there's been a, a shooting! There's a kid over there. Oh my god. I think there's more. There's more of them. Kind of safe. Uh huh. Got the shit out of me. Um, gonna look around. Hello. Hello. Anybody? Oh, we're in some kind of neighborhood. This is kind of weird. Okay, there's a tree house here. Uh, I saw a kid earlier. Maybe there's a kid here. <coughs> Anybody up there? Anybody up there? Um, okay. No ladder. <coughs> I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. <laughs> this one is the, there's a tea set here. I'd fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. Help! Silence. Silence, dude. We need to go upstairs. Uh, we need to go inside. Thing over here. I think there's nothing here. Let's just go upstairs. Let's do the house. I wonder if anybody's home. Yeah. Hello, everybody. Anybody? Hello. Anybody home? I need a little help. I need a little help. Okay, I think there's no possible way. Let's just open the sliding glass door. Coming in. Yeah, coming Don't in. shoot, okay? What's in here? Ah, oh my God. 
Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. Well, I think there's no person here. These people might need more help than I do. What's this? I think this, this is the house of the kid. Because there's a drawing here. It's kinda near. Ball of fruit. It's rotten. Damn. Oh, sir. Okay, what's this? Oh, Jesus. There's some freaking blood here. Anything here? Um, answering Maybe machine? there's something on there. Okay. Furniture overturned, blood everywhere. Jesus. Okay. What's that beeping? Cables out. Cables out. I already paid the cable. What? The? Okay, let's go um, over here. Hope there's no jump scares here. Okay, okay. There okay, are it's, three new messages. It's getting annoying. Let's go and pick it up. I'm gonna pick it up. What's Clementine, this? Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Oh no. Okay, so the kid's name is Clementine. Okay, okay. Daddy? Huh? No. There's a little voice over here. Oh, let's open the drawer. Okay, oh, there's a little talk here. Let me go to the Hello? 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 You need to be quiet. Okay. You need to be quiet. Are you okay? Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me. But I'm hiding until my parents come home. Um, uh, what's your name? What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. How old are you? How old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. Where are, your Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Um, are you safe? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. Yeah, that's smart, kid. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. I can see you, kid. Oh my gosh. Oh my. <laughs> Oh no no no! Kill 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 kill! I need something. Oh my! Oh shoot! Ah! Clementine, not in the door. Kill that woman! Kill that woman! Clementine! Come on, time. Give me that. Okay, okay, okay. Give me that. Smash. Ah. I'm sorry. I think this is Sandra. Ooh. Oh my gosh! The face of the woman. Of this freaking zombie. Man. <laughs> Hi there. Thank you, kid. Thank you, kid. Did you kill it? Um, I don't... Yes. Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. Uh, I think so, too. Yeah, I think so, too, kid. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while. 
you know? Oh. Look, Sorry. I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Uh, I'm gonna look for help before it gets dark. Do this. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Because it's too dark. Let's go. Stay close to me. I'm not gonna go. Where am I going? Let's go Clementine. Oh my. Oh, there's some... Oh, man! I ain't never getting home to Mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Can we open this? What's the matter? Should I stay? What? But I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Mm, I won't leave you alone. I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. It's a good idea, Clementine. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Oh. Um, what are you. What's going on? Do you know what the hell this is? No idea. So you've seen them then. You could say that. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee. This is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm, I'm just some, some guy. Some guy? Yeah. She's alone? Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... The monster's coming. You gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. Let's go back to help us. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You're just some guy? It seems like you saved a bunch of lives today. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Reckon down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. Yeah, hello. You've brought a couple guests. 
your boy a lifesaver. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. I think so. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Uh, could be worse. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? Uh, it's Lee. It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Ugh. How'd this happen? <laughs> car accident. Car accident. That's so. Where were you headed before the car accident? Um, uh, home. Home. Where's home? I grew up in Macon. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl. Nobody. Is that so? Yeah. It is. You said we. That's all. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Uh, Your son's to... right. You're going to want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We got to do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. Thanks, thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> we'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. Hey, All right, then. All right, then. Let's go, Clementine. Okay. We're gonna sleep here at the barn. It smells like... Shit. Shit. <gasps> I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that. That was a swear. <laughs> It's okay, girl. I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? So Pretty bad. far. Oh, far. okay. Okay, let's go sleep now, Clementine. I think you safe. This place is safe, so. I love you, baby. It's so bad. <laughs> Hey, get up. Mm. Oh, I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of a fence. There's a tractor 
burn everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Uh, for... Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable trait lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hampers. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My yes. family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Um, sure, we'll tag along. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. 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 That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I Woo! can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Okay. Okay, let's, let's go. Here. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Okay. And... Hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. <laughs> so, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? Oh. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Uh... No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. That's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. <laughs> so how, how did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just past people over some just just uh, it's okay yeah, it's fine okay. you don't have to say anymore okay, i want to go home tomorrow but even then i can't take away the things we the things doc went through don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this uh -oh. anybody in their right mind would families and barbecues and beers with good friends all of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. It's the pool. Um. It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Okay. okay. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any Need help? Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I think okay. I've got it handled okay. As long as I keep her safe, I think I'm doing all right. With those things out there, maybe. Sure, that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. Oh, okay. I'll keep that in mind. I think you have a point. Uh, how's, how's your son, son doing? doing? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. What's your so plan? what's your family's plan? 
Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See you. See ya. Thank you. Thank you, Kenny. So I'm gonna walk around here. Walking, walking, walking. Let's go to the two guys over here. The kid. Oh my gosh. Let's talk. Let's talk to Doc. Hey, Doc. How are you Let's doing, Doc? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. And okay, that's it. How you doing, Doc? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bureau. I'm good. And it's Dr. Sean. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Okay, okay. Let me help you. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Um, damn. Damn. Oh shit, damn. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. I bashed a poor girl's brains in. Whoa. I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. You're welcome. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. And thanks again, thank you. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Okay. Let's go to your dad. Because he's gonna need some help. Oh, that's okay. Let's talk to Herschel. You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure I follow. I ain't dumb. I caught you in that lie last night about who you were with in that car. <laughs> and honestly, I don't even want to know. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. That's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Okay. Oh, sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. 
Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Oh my gosh. Run, run, what? Go! I'll get my gun! What is that? Oh my god, it broke. Oh no, it's been beaten. I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. I can fix you, don't worry. We'll stitch you up. It, it almost... It almost got me, man. It, they tried to save me. I know, son. I... Uh-oh. Good, I'm sorry. What the hell, Kenny? Why didn't you help him? For you, furious. Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. You tried to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. I wasn't strong enough. I'm sorry. If your girl is ever trapped, you better hope you get stronger, or your friends are cowards. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. Oh no, sorry, we're sorry, Hershel. Let's go, Kenny. Got that ride to make it if you want it. Well, this is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Okay, where I is our first stop here? Look! Oh my god. Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Oh, no. That's not good, Fuck! Ah, you're so nice, dude. We're trapped! Ah! No! 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 Hey, get in! Run! Get in, get in, get in! Dude, lock the door, lock the door. Okay. 
can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die, either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? Yep. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I... I have to pee. <laughs> I'd go out there again in a second. I bet you would. Then just go! They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. Lee, can you believe this lady? That lady's my daughter. I can see the resemblance. My son won't grow up to be a raging fucking lunatic, that's for certain. Son? Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body. We'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll it's, handle it. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Key's behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch! She won't. And if she does... The first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! Knock this guy out. Happily. Jesus! Oh, oh man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Jesus! What the hell? Ah. Ah. You have a gun? You okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Just great, thanks. And we alarm the... Uh, guys? Uh, everybody down! Stay quiet! They're gonna get in! Shut up! I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and the Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Ah! Ah! What happened? What's wrong with you, Blitz? What's wrong with it? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there, behind the counter where the pills are. 
to the office. Probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Uh, You're insane. Well, it's got to get done. Plus, I'm quick, and I know make it. Local. Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Okay. Now get him those pills. So he is the boss now. Okay, so I think I'm gonna end the video here. If you like this video, drop a like, leave a comment. And also, just, just subscribe. Otherwise, I hope you enjoy it. Bye-bye. Peace out.